we've got 500 milliliters. 500 milliliters is just 500 milliliters, and it's going at 75 milliliters per hour, okay? So, those are our puzzle pieces. We're, we'll put hour on the top, 75 mLs on the bottom. Now, we've got milliliters on the bottom, so I'll put my milliliters on the top to cancel it out, and because it's by itself, I'll just put it over one. 500 divided by 75 is six in all these six repeatings, right? So the whole number is going to be the hour part. The part that's behind the decimal are going to be your minutes. So I need to multiply everything that's behind the decimal by 60 because there's 60 minutes in an hour to get my minutes. So 0.66 times 60 it's going to be 39.6. We're going to round this to the nearest minute, okay? So that's going to be 40 minutes. So we have six hours and 40 minutes for this to complete, right? So it says, what time will it be done? So we use military time in nursing, right? So if you start at 10.30 and we add 6.40, wouldn't it look like, wouldn't it look like that? That's not a real time, is it? When I have something like this, that's like 30 minutes or 40 minutes or whatever, I just borrow my time from my infusion time. So to get to the next whole hour, which would be 11 o'clock, you just add 30 minutes, right? So I'm going to take my, whoop, I'm going to take my 30 minutes from over here. So it still be six hours in 10 minutes, right? So now I can add my six hours and 10 minutes to 11 o'clock. So that'll be 10 and then that'll be 17. So my end time would be 17, 10.